Johnny. You ain't dying yet. I got you. Johnny. That smells the sea breeze. Get up. Pacific's beautiful this time of day. Almost flatlined by that attack. Almost. We in uh, Pacifica? What's this building? Old hotel, the Pistis Sophia. We're her sole guests right now. Wanted to show you something. Come on. Saw the pseudo-endotrizine in your hand. Can't very well function in this body without it, right? Got this strange impression your comatose self wanted to get rid of me. Actually put up a good fight. Ah! Chrome. If I'd wanted full control, I'd have taken it already. Lots earlier. Think I woke up. Derailed your plan in the nick of time. And I think fear of death's got you spewing misdirected anger. Climb through the window. Can manage that, I think. Ah! You wanted to know why I brought you here. There's a hidey hole where I'm standing. Open it. Empty it. yours they were belong to you now why are you giving me these imagine we're deployed together fighting in a war side by side would you take a bullet for me <laughs> dumbass question yes or no i i don't know answer me I would. Yeah. Tags belong to a man who sacrificed his life for mine in Mexico. Been thinking about our predicament. Want to be clear. I will do you no wrong. When the time comes, it'll be my life for yours. I'll agree to get white. Tags are proof of my promise. Kind gesture, I guess. You can't really give me something I already have. Body's mine. Always has been. It's my decision. Not Let's not intruders. talk on it anymore, for now, okay? You seriously considering Hanako's offer? Don't start again. Listen, you'll do what you think's right. You're in charge here. Just got one request. Well? Adam Smasher. Fucker who got the better of me. Whatever happens to me, I want him zero. Gone. Tossed into the wind is mulch. Right. Understood. And I want Rogue to be there with you. It's important to me. And it's just as important for her. Not sure Rogue's a sentimental type. Hmm. Bitter bitch these days, said it yourself. And it has been a while. 
So I'll jog her memory myself. You'll drop the pills from Misty, and I'll steer the ship for a bit. I'm not at all excited about this plan. Realize that, right? Just gonna have a quick chat with Rogue about Smasher. Then I'm out, I promise. I need to know exactly what you plan to do. I'll tell Rogue the truth, see if she's willing to help. Hey, Satan kicked me out of hell, thought I'd swing by. All I gotta do is mention Smasher, serve him up on a platter. Muse over the old days, easy. Fine, I'll do this, for you. Appreciate it, thanks. Take me to the afterlife. Promise, you won't regret this. Feeling better, should get going. Still feel a sharp something near your heart. Doubt that's ever going away. The hotel pissed to Sophia. That right? Mm-hmm. Good place to die. Just not today.
God, I feel sick. Don't like this at all. This porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news. Can you chill for two secs? We go in, we talk, we leave. That's it. She emptied the place. Shit. Excellent. You have come. Thanks for meeting me. Of course, V. And I thank you. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. Weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobu killed your father, now... I knew. From the start. You knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate, inconsistent. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it. Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a phone needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Power. Family. Our family. I was to be its heart. To uphold life, ensure continuity, stability, never to oppose it. Huh. Guess your Nobu's instructions were a little different. Yorinobu raised his hand against our father, but he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly, that it is difficult. Mm-hmm. He's your brother. It's been hard. It'll be hard. Let's say I get that. But what changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout, when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yorinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Take me for a fool. Think I'd fall for that? Got plans to walk out of here alive. Had I any ill intentions, I would have chosen a side far more discreet than this. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Meaning? Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City. Beneath Arasaka Tower. 
We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. And you'll help me in exchange for... My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Sounds like you want to avenge dead old dad. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama. そろそろご自宅にお戻りいただいてすぐに住むわ。Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify. Listen. Mind if I'm straight with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. And... I will need to return to their state soon. So as not to raise any suspicions. Offer's intriguing. Need to think about it. Naturally. But think quickly. Yorinobu is on high alert after the parade. He may harbor suspicions. Let's fly the fuck out of here. V, do you feel all right? Huh? You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Uh, Make your decision. I'll think it over. You could use some air, right now. <coughs> I warned you. What? What are you doing? Showing you what it's like to feel fucking trapped. Asked you, warned you, but you've insisted on not giving a shit. Now this porcelain cunt's gonna use you in her fancy scheme. You got a problem with that? Because that's what we wanted. We know where the to gates find... to Makoshi. Yeah, beneath Saka Tower. And what's that give us? What? What's uh -huh. that fucking give us? Don't want to team up with Hanako. Can't blame you. Neither do I. What do you say to doing things the old-fashioned way? We make some calls. Load up on iron. Then we kick down the door to our Sokka Tower. You want to lead an all-out assault on Sokka Tower? Jesus Christ. You can barely stand on your own two but feet. Johnny. Great, you checking out again? What am I? No, that's not what you said. Not yet. Easy there. Don't move just yet. Vic? You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. How... How'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Big Misty, a hell of a fright. Then, you shoved my patient at the time off the table and demanded you be treated immediately. 
Calumet was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh, wasn't completely myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. Just give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up carefully. I'll try. I think I'm getting some feeling back. Ah! Just slowly. Ah, another victory for the history books. Something to say, Vic. Just say it. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you will be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? take matters into my own hands the fuck you think I've been doing well whatever it is it keeps landing you on my table now see that setup over there uh-huh you'll find something there that'll help you end this on your own terms if you can manage to cross those few yards the rest will be up to you and you alone. On your own terms, huh? Really subtle there, Doc. Give it a fucking rest, Johnny. It's my decision. And I gotta think about it. I need to stretch your noodle. noodle? Fine. Fine. Just not, Just in, not this in this basement. basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Out loud, what? Just go fix this thing. Uh, I think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. Hey, V, I heard... Well... Your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy... ...for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure, lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie, what's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. Top floor. He had the same glum face. Who, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. 
Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumba's on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm -hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but... He found the courage to bet on himself. After. I brought him here. Ah, that's more like it. Air. See that? I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Be alone with my thoughts. Near on unachievable these days. So what... What did Jackie decide up here? Oh, you know. Gonna be a legend in this city. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That would you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way. Just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. No, not really my style. Goodbyes. You do you. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think, it all started in a fucking landfill. Mm hmm Then you tried to kill me. Exactly what I mean. Here we are now, together, soaking in this vista of Night City. My only regret's that I won't get to see how it all ends. You're the one who rejects the only option we got left. Cooperating with monsters like them, anything's better. I think it's worth taking a chance in Arasaka. The fuck was that? God, how are you so fucking stubborn? Inherited your finer traits. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. Yeah, just don't freak out. Honestly, couldn't give a gnat shit. Got a feeling you're gonna regret this decision. And the moment that dawns, I won't be there to help. Could be my last ride, this. If it don't work out, uh... Just wanna be there for it. Where? Johnny? Okay, just me now. At last. Your offer, I accept. You took your time. In the interim, Yorinobu has made his move. What do you mean? My brother has made me his guest at his residence in North Oak. Locked you in? Yes. His people watch over me for my safety. Yeah? Well, I'll get you out. Can be pretty persuasive. I thank you. Where are you? At Victor's, my ripper dock. Back behind a small shop called Misty's Esoterica. I will send someone for you. They will drive you to the residence. Then we shall visit my brother together at Arasaka Tower. Is that you, V? Or... Yeah, it's me. So, what now? 
Waiting for my driver. Come inside. We'll wait together. Since you have to wait, mind if I give you a reading? Why not? Some believe uncertainty is an evil that should be dispelled through divination. Others claim it's change that is evil. But that isn't true either. Every minute of every day, we each become someone new. We shouldn't fear change itself, but only who we might change into. Knowing one's path is most important. I devised this layout especially for you and Johnny. Your future is his future, and vice versa. Okay, I'm ready. We'll start with you, V. The Fool. <laughs> what a surprise. Let's dig deeper to find its meaning here. The Fool symbolizes the start of a journey. The announcement of something new. It's the inner child, curious of the world, but also naive and reckless. <laughs> Sounds a lot like the V I first met. The magician. A person of great talent and charisma. A leader. Sounds like Johnny. A card is reversed. That can mean a tendency toward addiction, mental instability. Okay. Definitely Johnny. He is one great disturbance. The final cards are about your futures. The devil. Got another deck lying around? A cheerful one? This is no joke, V. An inverted devil symbolizes subjugation, losing control, aggression, evil, a power struggle. Whatever you're planning, treat this as a warning. <sighs> okay. And Johnny's? The moon. Well, that doesn't sound too bad, right? I don't know, V. The moon is mystery. <laughs> I think that's for you. Wait. Is that... an Arasaka stretch? That's right. But... V... They killed Jackie and... And now you're working for them? Think I don't remember? I don't like it any more than you do. But all the other options were worse. Betraying a friend... You can't justify that. You've got no right to judge me. You've changed. For the worse. So, this is where Arisaka's finest technology wound up. Charming. Where's the Vipa? Telling fortunes from rat bones in the back? That's right. Matter of fact, just foretold I'd break your shit spewing jaw. Remember the last time I did that, I trust. I do. But I also recall what we spoke of that day. The construct in your head, and how it could affect decision-making. The same construct that, in its former life, detonated two nuclear warheads inside Arasaka Tower. And now, you and this construct have volunteered to sort things out in Arasaka. Interesting coincidence, wouldn't you say? I don't mean to rush you, but... I got Johnny in check with beta blockers, and Arasaka's not on my radar. It's simple. My life's on the line. Hmm. I shall be watching you. Let us go.
We are almost there. Why has she not called? Who? Hanako? I fail to see what you and your sharp wits are doing here. Or why I am here. Driving Master V. Easy on her, all right? I'm gonna damage the fucking wheel. What am I? Your chauffeur? I didn't agree to this. <laughs> Neither did I, matter of fact. So just shut up and drive. for the fun part. The limo is Arisaka, but there will be guards past the checkpoint. Try to act natural. Or rather, just be still and calm, and this will all go smoothly. Is everything in order? No one is allowed onto the estate until further notice. By order of Yorinobu Arasaka. Hanako is expecting us. Be a good chap and don't make this difficult. Hmm? By order of Yorinobu Arasaka. You must be joking. Surely you know my face. I do. But not his. Identify yourself. Name's V. Absolutely mental! Blast it all! What now? They won't let us anywhere near her. Have to plow right through them, then. Knock yourself out. You fetch Hanako, I'll sort out the AV. I am in the bedroom in the central part of the building. Anders, you get the AV. But first, we must neutralize the four guards. V, is your task clear? Uh-huh. We neutralize. I will obstruct their communications so that no support arrives. now. There are five more guards outside, and a dweller in the garage on the left.
Sector clear. Here. You must neutralize them. All of them. Together! You have no chance of escaping. Fuck. Someone... <laughs> Oh, my God. 
I need cover! 